Sell Your Car UK is back and delighted to offer for sale this gorgeous Audi A3 1.6 S line. It's on a 2008 58 plate. It was first registered almost four and a half years ago, so it's still a baby, and it has only done 35,000 miles. It's a one owner from new car, is MOT'd until December 2013, taxed until the end of November 2013, and it was last serviced in February 2013. This has been a very well looked after car and it is in really lovely condition. It's based in London, so there are some marks on the car and I'll come round to them in due course, but just so you can have a little look around it without coming down to see it, I'm gonna show you all the details of this here on YouTube. You can as well check out our Facebook channel, uh, facebook.com forward slash sellyourcaruk.tv has an album of photographs of this car so you can get up close and personal and you don't have to travel all the way down to see it. It's in this gorgeous metallic grey. It's a three door. And now let's get up close and personal here on YouTube as well. There are some marks on it. They've been touched in, in fact. You can just see there on the dash. Oh, hello, you can see me. Uh, that's not a dash, that's a bonnet. Uh, you can just see there on the bonnet, that's been touched in. Uh, if you wanted to have the whole bonnet resprayed because of that and that, uh, you'd be looking at spending about 200 pounds. There's also a tiny, tiny little dimple dent. You can just see it rippling away there in the light on the bonnet as well. But when you stand back, those marks just vanish. What marks? Uh, there's also one just down here on the front splitter on this very funky bit of styling. Uh, it's been marked though, maybe a stone or I don't know what, maybe hit a curb or something. Uh, if you're having trouble seeing these on the video, do check out Facebook. You'll see all the pictures there. Uh, you can see here, we've got some marks Oh, you can see me again. Uh, tiny, tiny little marks. I'm being very, very fussy. Uh, but I want to make sure you know exactly what you're getting with this car, uh, which is why we're doing this video. Uh, now, on this side here, there's no marks, there's no dents, there's no scratches, there's no scuffs. All the corners are good. Uh, the wheels have a tiny, tiny bit of curbing, but that's to be expected in a London-based car. And indeed, if we were to refurb that, it would probably be 24 hours before we'd need to do it all over again. This wheel is clean not a mark on it. All the tires are good, all the brakes are good. It's in lovely condition. You've got rear parking sensors on the bumper around here. Again, no marks, no scuffs, no scratches. It's in lovely nick. And I'm a lovely nick here at Sell Your Car UK. But uh, uh, there's a little mark there on this wheel. I'm being really fussy here, but the reason I'm doing this is to save you time. You know exactly what you're coming down to see if you're coming down to see it and we have priced everything accordingly. So for example, where you do need to get wheels refurbed if you so desired, uh, we have actually reduced the price because of it. So if these wheels were already refurbed and mint, well, you'd be paying a little bit more for the car. Again, tiny, tiny little marks here. Um, I don't know if they're showing up. I'm being really picky. They're very, very slight and small, but they are there. So I wanna make sure you can see it for yourself. And that's the exterior of the car. It's in great nick. And I'm a great Nick. Oh, I must stop doing that joke. Uh, the wing mirrors are cleaned. As you can see, not a mark on them. Uh, let's go inside. It's got half leather, half cloth interior with the chrome surround. Things like the door trim, for example. You've got electric windows in the front, electric mirrors and heated mirrors and electrically folding as well. Uh, on the light side of things, you've got daylight automatic running lights as they call them DRL there. So they stay on whilst you're driving during the day multi-function steering wheel so you can control your stereo it's also got linguatronic there for voice control although i've never known them to work very well and if we jump into the car which i'm doing right now i'll just take you through all the bits and bobs here in the dashboard display so we'll just turn the key see that it starts absolutely fine no trouble whatsoever all the warning lights go off except for the one telling me to take the handbrake off and put my seatbelt on but we're not going for a drive so i'm not going to do that uh, down here you can see, oh, just about anyway, that is 35,035 miles exactly. Check out Facebook if you want to see the pictures. Uh, and if I just scroll through the service schedule here as well, uh, we can see here, if I just go to check and then go to service, it's telling me the next oil change is due in 8,900 miles. Again, check out Facebook or 324 days. 
and uh, as well as that I can just go back to service and that's showing 9,700 miles for the next service or again 324 days. That last service was done on the 26th of February uh, of 2013 so you won't need to do that again for a while. Uh, let's come back out of there. Uh, we can see as well the engine oil, the temperature is showing as it's a cold engine, 67 degrees Celsius. No idea whether that's important or not. Uh, we've got both keys for the car as it says, two sets of keys are programmed to it. I think that's enough of all of that stuff. Uh, we will come out of that. And you've got this very funky little thing here, it's showing 25.2 miles to the gallon, uh, 105 miles to empty. Very, very smart little system this. Big fan, big fan. Uh, great build quality as well. You've got the stereo system here, which has a CD player, radio, all the bits you'd expect. And down here, you've got dual zone climate control. So all you need to do is put on the air conditioning. Hi, how you doing? And the fans are working away. And you control the right hand side with this little switch here. And you control the left hand side with this little switch here. And it's all working absolutely perfectly. It gets hot when it needs to, as it's doing right now. And it gets cold as well, instantly. Uh, if I just turn that there and buzz that all the way around to low. That is, uh, well, you can't feel it, but I can assure you that is cold. Uh, and if I do this one all the way up here, this side of the car now on the left is hot and this side is cold. Hello. Terrible, I've got terrible jokes in this car for some reason. Uh, anyway, uh, the condition of the seats are okay. They could maybe do with a little bit of a shampoo because that cloth it's got some little marks on it, but that will all come out with the shampoo. Uh, you've got these very funky S-line seats, so they've got lots of lumbar support. And they've also got Isofix in the back and in the front as well. Those little bars down there so you can plug your children in up the front. You've got an armrest here as well, although this clip here has broken. So when you lift the armrest out of the way, that just drops open. That's pretty standard. That happens all the time on these cars. Um, not to worry about it, it still works fine. Uh, you've got an auxiliary port here so you can plug in your iPod, little headphone jack, uh, and uh, you've also got a little charger here as well. No cigarette lighter, uh, you would have had to have got the smoking pack to have got that. So that's the inside of this car, as you can see, it's absolutely lovely. Grr roaring at me there. I will turn it off though and in true Sell Your Car UK style, before this video is finished, we're going to go round to the boot. Hello again. How are you doing there? Oh, I need to brush my hair. And as we head round to the boot, the reason we're going in here is just to show you that we've got loads of docks and as well we've got a spare tyre, locking wheel nut and all the tools. We'll get to that. First and foremost though, service history. Last service, as I said, was done in uh, February 2013, 26th of Feb to be precise, at 34,550 miles. You can see for yourself, that was 500 miles ago. And that had an oil change and an inspection. It was serviced before that in December 2011. And again before that, in uh, what looks like, oh, I don't know, actually, that says October 62. In true Audi style, they've put not put the date down here, which is very annoying of them. Uh, we've got another one here for 8,257 miles. There is a bill here, actually. I wonder if this is related to it from the 18th of December 2008. Uh, and the mileage on there is 20 something thousand miles. Uh, oh, sorry, no, this is from December 2011. I was going to say, that doesn't make sense. That's the registration date. I do apologise. Uh, so 17th of December 2011, this service is from. So we've got our bill. We've got an MOT here. The MOT actually expires, though, on this uh, in December 2013. You've got the V5 certificate showing only the one owner from you. You would be the second owner. And you've got all of the handbooks as well with this very neat little wallet. And there's even a small bottle of oil for you as well. Uh, warning triangle is here. Spare wheel is here. Locking wheel nut, all the tools, unused. This tire has never been on the car, as you can see from that yellow line there. It's just a space saver. So that is all the bits and bobs. You've got split folding rear seats as well. So you can load up the car with all the bits and bobs you need to, and you can drive it as you like. It is a lovely car. It will make somebody very, very happy. And it is only available exclusively through Sell Your Car UK.